All right, guys, welcome back. Okay, we're here to do the home fragrance non bath and body works items. Am I crooked? Are you crooked? Am I crooked? I don't know. Okay, non bath and body works items. Okay, so here we have all the home fragrance items um, that are non bath and body works. I mean, come on, why am I repeating myself? <laughs> so we'll start with this ginormous container in guava sunset from homeworks look at it it's beautiful uh, oh my god oh well don't look at that huge scene beautiful okay let me see if i can show you the inside actually i want to show you the inside it looks ugly but look at this you see where those are they floated like that you see where that wick is it's on the wall upside down man if I, it, look, this is my first Homeworks purchase. It was purchased from Ulta. Yes, I've heard the bad things. I've experienced the bad things. So people say Ulta shipping is terrible, that Harry Slatkin, Homeworks by Harry Slatkin, is working with, um, with them to just do better. They need, they need it in general because not only did these candles come crazy, I ordered some eyelash glue and the box came squished. Not the box that the eyelash glue was in. Okay, the box that the eyelash glue came in was squished. Not the box that everything came in. And the eyelash glue was rolling around. They, they need some help, y'all. Somebody need to help them. So, this candle is two for 40. So I got two, you'll see the second one. It's a four wick candle. I love that. To me, I'm like, the more wicks, the better probably not a thing it's probably not a thing but look how beautiful this is definitely worth the twenty dollars because this is 18 ounces i think bath and body works is what 10 ounces it's no bigger than this one so let me see what this is 14 ounces so it's, I, I think it's worth twenty dollars like especially if you do the two for 40 i think regular this is it's more than 20. That's what I've worked out. It is more than 20. I cannot think of it off the top of my head. Um, I was just, I, I was not in love with the scent, but I did love the candle. I will give his candles a second try. The throw is amazing. Um, and I, I have to contribute that to the four wicks. I don't know. But the throw is amazing. Um, let me put this down a little bit. Oop, not that far. Okay, but yeah, the throw is amazing. So, I would, if you, if you're interested, I would definitely, I, I will, I will be repurchasing a couple of different scents. Um, they also sell these on QVC and Amazon. So, oh, and HSN. So I do, I do QVC more than I do HSN. Haven't done either in a, a hot minute though. Here we have Goose Creek Weekend Getaway. It smells really good. It smells really good. For some reason, I thought it was going to smell like Endless Weekend. I, I can smell the burn on this one. I mean, the burn, the wax on this one a little bit. So this is their three wick. Look how clean. Oh my gosh. I didn't do anything to this. That's how it burned. The, look at that. That's crazy. Down to the, like, oh. Bath and Body Works could never. They could never because they can't seem to get that part together. Um, we can get away doesn't have any notes because one of Goose Creek's major flaws, they don't put the notes. Um, also the packaging is just all right. Would I repurchase this particular scent? No, I would not, but I have already repurchased some Goose Creek stuff. So there goes that. So I got these tea lights from home goods and there were 24 for five dollars because i think they were last year's christmas items um but again i've told you guys i can't smell tea tea lights even when i do have four burning at a time and what i really loved about this and this is honestly worth the five dollars by itself look at this this is like the perfect container for tea lights push that back so i keep this i will be keeping this and refilling it with tea lights because it's the perfect way to keep your tea lights unlike this thingy which i also used oh did i tell you about these tea lights 
they were okay, nothing special. Home goods on sale. Would I repurchase them? There's 24 for five, so yeah, I would. Not that I'll be able to find those. Unlike these, this packaging is terrible. Once you open it, everything rolls around all over the place. It looks crazy. So I finished these and I recently hauled these guys for you guys, but I use four tea lights at a time. I just said that. And this is in salted caramel. Let me tell you, these tea lights made me eat my words. I could smell them. They were so strong, like so strong. And they smell like salted caramel. Would I repurchase? For $5, yes, I would. At the original price, no, I would not. Next, I have a Glade Sultry Spice Rhythm. I got this at Dollar Tree. They are cheaper elsewhere, but if you're already at Dollar Tree, I'm not one of those people who drive around. Okay, I thought this was empty, but now I'm like, is it empty? Oh. <laughs> it smells like man. It smells really good. It smells like man. I'm gonna try to take this back into the bathroom for a second. I don't know how that came out, me thinking it was empty. Um, I have another salted caramel that I finished. Yes, I do go through these quickly. You are correct. So this is how it looks burned. I purposely kept this one. Um, these are deeper too. I just feel like you get your money's worth with these. These are so much deeper than the average tea light. So they stay lit about six to seven hours. And I only like these in a storm, but Georgia storms has summer storms. Like we have summer storms. That's just a thing. It's almost like, think about Florida. If you've ever been to Florida in the summer and you think like, oh, I'm going to be outside all day and it's never going to rain and everything's going to be hot and sunny. No, it's going to be hot and sunny majority of the day. And then when you're least expecting, it's going to downpour on you. And then the sky is going to open up and the thunder and the lightning is going to roll for like an hour and it's going to go away and it's going to burn you and dry you up almost. The sun will. Georgia gets that too. Um, not as frequent, I would say. So throughout the day, we might get it towards the end of the day. Whereas Florida will be like every two hours on and off next i have another glade in one of my favorite scents got it from dollar tree and this is blooming peony and cherry nothing in there but i highly recommend um this is my favorite glade scent of all time yeah that's true of all time favorite glade scent and i would repurchase in fact i have repurchased you'll see later so, I'm trying to get this bigger item. Here we have the Homeworks by Harry Slatkin. This is the Hot Cider Donut. Now, this was recommended by literally everyone on YouTube. And I'm going to have to further that by recommending it to you. Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. I'm going to show you the inside. Yes, it does look crazy. I don't know. I don't know if this is a shipping situation. It did not burn all the way down. I had to put this on the warmer. Um, honestly, if I had to go back and purchase, I don't even, don't even say that. I don't have, nobody has to make me twist my arm or nothing. I'm going back to buy two of these. Two for the 40, two for the, my dog just came in. My husband was supposed to be watching him while I film. But they're two for 40 and I will be getting two of these because this was so good. Like the, did I say apple cider donut? It's hot cider donut. It just, oh man, that is a good scent. It is the sprinkled sugar. Like, I don't know the notes on this. Oh my gosh, I do. So this is harvest apple, cinnamon sugar, vanilla bean, and spice cider. And it is to the T. And then look how lovely this wraparound is. And the, the way they cut it, it didn't cut it off right there. So, like, these donuts look so good. Like, they make me want to eat this candle. The scent makes me want to eat this candle. This candle is great. Highly recommend. Would repurchase and will repurchase. Let me head back over to the Guava Sunset. Because I feel like because I didn't like this candle, I kind of skipped over it. But the notes are pink guava, juicy nectarine, fresh papaya, and coconut water. If that gives you any... Um, any idea what it might smell like okay so i think we're getting to the 10 minute mark so i'm gonna cover this one last <gasps> okay 
Okay, I'm gonna cover this one last item. Hey, baby, it's my puppy. <laughs> He's like right under me. I'm gonna cover this one last item as I pet down, like reach down to pet him. And this is the Airwix Essential Oil and Woodland Mystique. I actually only used the last one. That's what drops and rolls. Um, terrible, smelled bad, was upset that I bought three at a time. Won't be doing that again. Only purchasing two at a time if I cannot purchase one at a time. This was so powdery and it did not smell like any sort of woodland mystique, no kind of cinnamon. They have cinnamon on here, some sort of nut, a pine cone. They have cloves, none of that came through. Only th all that came through was powder and powder. No, don't do it. Don't do it to yourself. Okay, we're at 10 minutes. I'm gonna skip to the next video. It probably won't take another 10 minutes. We'll see. Oh, please subscribe below if you haven't and look at the other video that I did about household empties for the month of August.